if you want to make your WordPress website very very fast and rank on Google then you have to remove your unused things in this case unused CSS and this is one of the most important things that you have to remove so in this video I am going to show you how you can easily remove unused CSS and this if you remove unused CSS and this then your website will be super fast and it will help you to rank on Google please make sure you have subscribed our channel if you subscribe our channel we will get more inspiration to make more useful tutorials in future if you subscribe our channel you don't need to cost so it's totally free please subscribe and give inspiration to us we are going to remove unused CSS and this for this website and for this first step at the top right corner you will see three dot click on here and then you will see more tools then click on developer tools and then you will see again three dots at top right corner click on there and then you will see again more tools from here click on coverage when you click on coverage you will see new window here and you can increase the size and you will see here reload button so simply click on reload button must you will be able to remove all unused css and this without any plugin so watch this video from first to last if you miss any step then you will not be able to remove unused css and this and you will not get better result at the last then you will see unused bytes most of the css are not using from this file you will see all the list this and css the top priority is this file so you have to double click on here and then you will see here a new window and the red marks are not using you can see red marks CSS are not using anymore so we have to remove those CSS already we have get the list of CSS which are not using anymore those colors means those CSS are using and red colors means CSS are not using anymore so our main point is now we have to remove those CSS which are marked with red color how i can get this file for this you have to follow this folder we can see here site name slash wb content slash uploads slash fusion styles then the css file name you can also open this on new tab so you can understand clearly for this we have to go there so site url slash wp content you have to go your uh, theme folders so our site is live so we have to first go to on cpanel we are going to cpanel and from your cpanel you have to go on your file manager so click on file manager then follow uh, these steps site url slash wp content so first we have to go on this folder if your site is primary 
then directly go to public underscore html you will get all folders here but our site is not primary that's why we will see here a new folder called our website name so open it and then where we have to go wp content so here is wp content enter and inside this we have to go on uploads so where is uploads we have to search here it is so open and from here fusion styles you can see here fusion styles then open and then we have to search our css file so copy the name and here press ctrl plus f and then search our css file here is the css file we can download it so by double clicking we are downloading then simply open you will see the same css here are the red marks we are not using so we have to delete those so you can see same css so suppose at the top this line we are not using so you have to delete from here and then those are not using long list before this classes we are not using 422 lines we are not able to find the lines here but we can see the class so scroll down and yeah till the latin we are going to delete so copy sorry select select all unused css all css we have to select and delete or you can cut then you will see other css which are not using any more you will see more classes so you have to find from here and just delete and after deleting all css i am not showing for all unused css i showed the method just so save and from here search the css file again then delete this you can simply delete and then upload the saved css file again then this is our downloaded and edited css open and it's uploading and then go back we we'll see here our css files already uploaded again so if you download again and now after downloading we can see unused css are not using anymore so in this way you can easily uh, remove unused css and for the js the method is same so you have to go here again then you have to search for who is our js so this is jquery or suppose this js folder then you will see the red marks which are not using you can see here those js are not using in the same way you have to search for this this folder are uh, like wp content slash plugins if we go back 
if we go back then go to home then uh, our site and then contents and then plugins now we have to search uh, for this plugins testimonial free so here we can see testimonial free and then public public access then this and then slick dot mean dot this click dot mean dot this you can edit directly from here to click on edit or you can download and after editing you can upload again so from here you will see the red marks you can see bar e this this line and from here you have to search those lines the red mark lines those lines simply search and delete from here and then make some changes so in this way you can easily uh, remove unused css and this and now we are going to see the website speed uh, we are going to use gt matrix to see the scores and now select our website this is our website then test your site now you can see a great result as a speed this is super super speed you can see here the result is really really awesome so in this way you can simply remove unused css and this from your wordpress website and please hit the subscribe button and stay connected with rb and web solutions thank you